Hey guys, Natasha with the Day of the Vlog. Two of my most favorite people in the world that write some a great series and just make your heart full. Ella Fox and Rochelle Page teamed up and now they have this new series, Love and Under the Lights. This is Gage. Gage Ryan and Morgan Kelly are off the charts, the it couple. Gage is 42 years old and he is, you know, the sexy bachelor in Hollywood, never going to have children, kind of just like suave, debonair. He is tall, dark, and handsome and he knows it and he doesn't care that he's the playboy. Morgan Kelly is an up and coming rising star. Yes, she's been in soap operas for years, but now she's in a movie that is up for a Golden Globe and she just she's at the top of her game and she is the itch girl in Hollywood. She's at the Golden Globes with her best friend Allie and she stumbles into Gage Ryan. And in that instant, there's electricity, there is a pull, there is all these things. But Morgan knows he's a he-man, he's a he-whore, he's not gonna be interested in her. So she has those feelings and she pushes them aside. But Gage also has that same feeling and he wants more, he's interested and he wants to like find out everything. So the next morning he stalks her in a way and goes to her apartment and kind of starts this friendship. And she goes, you're gonna have to be extremely romantic to be with me. And in that moment, I fell in love with Morgan Kelly because guess what? That girl knew what she wanted, she explained it, she told, and Gage Ryan, he delivered. This guy pulled out all the stops and he took her on these amazing romantic, you know, dinners and dates to kind of woo her. And at that time, you just see that he is really trying to prove that he's gonna change. Yes, he's the man whore of Hollywood, but when he's with her, it's that moment of feeling clarity, like the fog has lifted and that's the person he needs to be with. And throughout, you read it and you just, you fall more passionate for Morgan and Gage's story because you see that he's, it's those little things. It's the, you know, the Kool-Aid that he puts on the airplane. And it's, you know, buying Carl's Jr. burger. It's those little things that he sees that makes Morgan feel happy. She doesn't care that he's worth millions and has all this fame and light. She just wants to be with Gage. And Gage just wants to be with her and in their presence. And it's kind of like this beautiful romance and you're reading it and there's these two Hollywood starlets. And that's what's fun about this story is that they're more than Hollywood. They are grounded and they see the bigger picture and you know, they just do the good things in life. And I've highlighted some things and it's just one of those things that um, Gage says, you're a half tornado, half angel. And he says it in this husky, sexy voice. What I was trying to say was that you're in, you're, you are when you are passionate about something, I will go ahead and add it to the list of things I'm attracted to you. And so that's the thing is these two are extremely attractive, but he knows the words to say to get her to kind of just be puddle in his arms. And same with Morgan. But over time, you see these two go from, you know, the honeymoon, sexy, can't keep their hands off each other, to truly, these two are in the couple. And you see how Gage, all of his walls and everything that people thought he was, break down and he becomes so much more. So guys, this is Gage, Love Under the Lights, book one, by Ella Fox and Rochelle Page. Get the book. Talk to you later. Bye.